Well, it may not have been the best pre-order experience, but Google's Nexus 10 is finally at our door. At least, I think so. The return address on this uh, unmarked box actually says UPS SCSGA Building 1 Dock Door 54. So, stay tuned after the break, and we'll do a little unboxing here and find out if this is the Nexus 10 or something from the Dharma Initiative. I'm Michael Fisher, and this is Pocket Now. Let's get to it. This unboxing brought to you by Old Timer for all your unboxing needs. That's not true at all. Uh, but uh, this is an old-timer knife. A gift from my grandfather, if you care, um, which you probably don't, but I like it. Let's see, mystery box coming open here. Incredible air bladders. Some paperwork from the Google Play Store, and look at that. Oh, cool. Let's get this mystery box out of here. Wow. Now that there is some distinctive product packaging. Cool. Taking a tour around here. Nexus 10 on the side, Samsung logo down below, some features on the back here. The best of Google indeed. Crisp is one word for the display that I imagine we're about to be impressed by. And the 16 gig Wi-Fi version there. Let's see if this is as difficult to, to open as the Nexus 7 was. The sleeve comes off and we're left with just a black box, product label down here with all the codes on it that you don't need to know. Aha! More tape. We should have unboxing music, shouldn't we? That'd be fun. This tape is surprisingly hardy. All right. Second, which side am I on here? Ah, very subtle little Nexus imprint there. Let's go for it. Ah, very easy. Not at all like the Nexus 7. Boom. And a very reflective device is staring us in the face. Let's go ahead and. Wow. Well. It is uh, light in the hand. Here's the back. Um, let's put this aside and just get the in-the-box stuff out of the way here. There's a little pull tab. USB cable. Product packaging, or excuse me, product information here. Power adapter. Oh, power adapter in multiple pieces. That's very nice. Let's see what else is going on here. Going to try and leave some of this a little intact for our friend Joe Levi, the Android guy. We'll be receiving this device later. Nothing else in the box. Put that back in. Very nice. So let's put this aside and come back to the device. Oh, heaven knows we like doing this. Here we go. Screen protector is going to come off here. That is one thick screen protector. I'll move that aside. Let's go ahead and take it off the back here as well. Very nice. And let's just have a look at the back here. Here's that dimpled pattern running along the top. Oh, and the plastic is, it is a tacky, a tacky plastic. Not at all like, uh, like a typical soft touch feel. This is quite different. Not in a bad way either. This this feels great in the hand. Uh, quite light, um, not too light. I mean, it's certainly not the lightest tablet I've ever uh, encountered. But uh, here's some little little thickness analysis there for you. And just for reference, uh, here is the Droid DNA alongside. Since many, not many of you probably have one of those, here is the Nokia Lumia 920 for comparison as well. Washed out in the in the white light. Sorry about that. Anyway, why don't we give this thing a first power on while we're taking a tour here? Uh, one, two, three. A little vibration buzz to confirm power on. There's our Goog branding. There's my face at the least flattering angle. 
there is. A little Nexus animation letting us know it's getting started. Let's have a look on the side here while it is happening. USB port and headphone jack on the left. Wow, and we're already here. Android's already ready for setup. Not going to be doing that. As, uh, as I told you, this is going to Joe, so I'm going to leave it be. But just to get a real quick detail on that uh, port on the right-hand side. I believe that's... don't know what kind of port that is, actually. And... Uh, dock port, dock connector down here with the pogo pins. We can't really quite get focus on that, which is a shame, but uh, you're you're familiar with these by now. So that is the Nexus 10 from Google and Samsung. I don't know about you, but I'm glad we solved the mystery of what's inside the box. We're going to have a lot more coverage on the Nexus 10, as well as our full review in the weeks ahead. So make sure you follow us on Twitter, PocketNow Tweets, so you don't miss it. Captain Two Phones is my Twitter account. That's Captain, the number two, phones. Make sure and leave a comment on the post at PocketNow.com if you have something to say. If you like the video, leave us a thumbs up here on YouTube, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.